Hello guys, my name is David Arok and I'm the founder of Eelspace and No Code Africa. I'm a technology entrepreneur and I'm also a Flutterflow ambassador. One of the things that I love to do is teach people how to build mobile and web apps without writing a single line of code. And that's one of the reasons why I created a YouTube channel where I teach people how to build uh, mobile and web apps without coding. And that's also the reason why I decided to create paid courses here on Udemy. All right, so uh, this particular course is going to teach you how to build a traveling mobile application without writing a single line of code. We will be using this UI UX design template here where uh, you will also have access to to create the mobile application using Flutterflow. So this is Flutterflow and our application is going to be built from here. This is the uh, storyboard where you get to see the connect the connection between each of our screens. These are all the screens that makes up our application. It's really, really complex and very interesting. So uh, this is the page where you can actually get to see some of the screens that makes up the application. So I will be showing you how to build all of these without writing a single line of code using Flutterflow. You're going to learn how to, you know, uh, create front-end designs using insights from the UI UX designs here in Figma and uh, you will learn how to replicate them directly into Flutterflow and create your application with it. So I will be showing you a whole lot of things from front-end development to back-end development and then in back-end development you'll be learning a lot of things that has to do with um, database and we'll be using Firebase as uh, Firebase for authentication, we'll be using Firebase for storage and even running cloud functions too. All right, so you're going to learn a lot of things about CRUD, which is the fundamental uh, of building softwares. It's an acronym that stands for create, read, update, and delete. You're going to learn that and with it, you will be able to build applications with Flutterflow without writing a single line of code. You're going to learn a lot of things about app states. You're going to learn a lot of things about queries, searches, conditional actions. And with this information, you will be able to turn your own idea or your client's idea uh, into a product, into a mobile application or into a web application without writing codes. Now, we're not going to just be building uh, the mobile app itself. We are also going to be building uh, the admin panel for this uh, application. So you're going to learn how to build the admin panel. This is the designs for the admin panel. You're going to learn how to, you know, uh, build the admin panel because uh, so many of my students were complaining before in uh, on the YouTube channel. They were asking questions like how can we get to uh, learn how to build an admin panel and I decided to create another course where you get to learn how to do an admin panel in your application. All right, so this is the admin panel itself. I'm just going to go ahead and uh, log into the admin panel. All right, so let's uh, just type this correctly. And with this admin panel, we'll get to see how the app looks like. So this is our admin panel. We get to see we have two users. Uh, we have two users in the platform. We have two destinations since it's a traveling mobile application and then we have zero bookings. All right, so you can actually click here to see the details of the users. You can see their names, the email, uh, dates joined and their booking, the number of bookings that they've had. Then you can click here to check destinations. And um, with this one, you can actually, uh, you know, figure out a lot of things. So you can actually click here to create a new trip destination. All right. And uh, you can click here to check uh, for bookings. There are no bookings right now. So we can go ahead straight and check out the application itself. So this is the application in Flutterflow. All right. So as a user, you can click here to check notification. All right. And um, you can go ahead. Uh, you can go ahead and click here. Either you can click here to search for destination. You can search for destination by just typing. Uh, or you can also just search for, you can go ahead and just maybe click on a particular destination and you can tap on these to open it and see more details about the destination. You can click here to book the destination. 
that's the trip the destination and then click these as your start date uh, then click these to pick your end date uh, and then you can click here to continue put your details here so I'm just gonna put my detail here and you can put your the user will need to put their uh, contact information all right and then select the number of people that they want to go on this trip with the kind of ID that they will be using and then the ID number then they can go ahead and click on the payment method and uh, here if at all they're a first-time user they will be given like um, a bonus to claim so they can actually go ahead and claim uh, their bonus and with that they don't need to use any of these to make payment they can just go ahead and uh, you know book for free and after booking for free they can explore all the places and after that they can actually check out a whole lot of other things like for instance this is like the web view of the application this is the web view of the application I could just click this to uh, reload the page so that you can see it for yourself so we can click here to check out the the trip itself so this is the trip that has just uh, been you know booked all right so it shows your status completed it shows the duration itself and then you can also check out the pages that you have had as your favorite pages all right you can check out your profile you can actually log out you can update your details upload your images all of these can be done in the application so i I actually created this uh, course with love because I want you to be able to like, you know, really, really understand how to use uh, Flutterflow to build application with our writing codes. And I believe that with these, you will be able to actually master it. So if we come back here to our admin panel, we can see that there is a booking. This is the booking. It shows the details here and uh, we can actually come over here to destinations and this is the destinations that we have oh, this is supposed to be pricing i'll have to correct this and then the users and the dashboard now we now have one booking at first it was zero bookings now we have one booking i hope that you're excited to learn this i will be teaching you this in very simple terms and with it you will understand how to you know build your application uh, execute a lot of logical uh, functionalities in your application and at the end of this course you're going to have the exact skill that you need to convert any kind of idea into uh, you know a mobile application without writing a single line of code so if at all you're excited about this just go ahead and then purchase the course and I will be waiting for you to, uh, you know, connect with me. And you can always drop questions wherever you have questions. I hope this is uh, very interesting to you. And I'll be looking forward to seeing you on the other side. Take care.